Kennedy, a tribute. Wait a minute, wait, wait, hold it, hold it. What's wrong? Bruce Kennedy, a tribute. What's wrong with tribute? I mean, don't you think that's a little bit pompous? Uh... Uh, okay, how about this? Bruce Kennedy, a salute. No, 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 that, that, that's not going to work either. I kind of like salute. You know, salute makes it sound like he's General Schwarzkopf. Well, he is an Eagle Scout. Look, we, we just want this to be a nice little videotape. Okay. About Bruce Kennedy's history. History, okay, history. I got you. All right. Bruce Kennedy, he's history. Look, hold it, hold it. Look, just forget the title. Just get on with the story, okay? Okay. Bruce Kennedy rushed boldly toward a career with Alaska Airlines in 1970. At first, he found it a difficult industry to get into, but he had a plan. Boy, that's hard on the corns. But once inside, Kennedy moved quickly to the top. When Kennedy and his pal Ron Cosgrave came aboard, Alaska was a small, struggling airline. Howdy, folks. Welcome to Alaska Airlines. How are you? Are those all your planes back there? Yeah, that's the entire fleet. What kind of clown is running this place? That's him standing over there. Hi, everybody. Uh, welcome to the puppet show. He's pretty good, isn't he? Our profits aren't what they should be, though. Time for a change? Definitely. In 1972, there was a friendly takeover at the board of directors meeting. All right, everybody keep their hands where we can see them. Come on. Let's go. Right, we're leaving. We're leaving. The Cosgrave is taking over now. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Well, I guess this is it, Ron. You're the CEO now. Yeah, Bruce, and together we're going to make Alaska Airlines a force in the industry. We want to be absolutely the best. You know, there's just one thing about it. Uh, you know, we don't really know anything about running an airline. Well, I rode on a plane once. The service wasn't very good. Wait a minute. That's it. We offer the best service, put together a solid financial plan. And we're set. Let's get started. I'll order in a pizza. Okay. Through the 1970s, Kennedy became instrumental in piloting Alaska to new heights. I don't think we're going to have any trouble catching up with the competition. That's them just up ahead of us there. And when Cosgrave retired, Kennedy took over the company leadership during the exciting times of deregulation taking bold opportunities for expansion. Okay, Horizon, you're part of the Alaska family now. Now let's head over to Jet America. Kennedy promoted good employee relations. That's a very nice uniform. Thank you very much. Satisfied customers. We uh, love that face painted on the tail section. Thanks. And happy shareholders. The shareholders are here, Mr. Kennedy. Are you happy? You want to know if we're happy, huh? I was kind of wondering. Are we happy? We're serving 35 cities, we got a long-term fleet plan, a whole new corporate look, and we're making bigger profits every year, and you want to know if we're happy? <laughs> <laughs> Are they happy? It's kind of hard to tell. Kennedy knew the secret to success was teamwork. Thanks to you, and I mean everybody. Alaska Airlines has become the best airline in the continental United States. Uh, excuse me, can you repeat that? I'm not sure. But we're sure going to try because that's what this company is all about. I want to remind everybody about this weekend's officer's planning session. We're going to do a little bonding and climb Mount Everest. So, um, wear some good shoes and uh, I'll see you this weekend. Oh, 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 oh. The Kennedy years have been a time of achievement bringing Alaska to the international borders of Mexico and the Soviet Union, to the big board of the New York Stock Exchange. And Alaska expects to double the size of the fleet before the turn of the century, and is acquiring the impressive MD-90. Are we gonna have any trouble bringing this in? No, he's turning on the fog buster. Good. And so Kennedy says goodbye to the company that owes him so much. So long, Bruce. 
We're sure going to miss you around here, Bruce. Oh, come on. What are you going to do? Where are you going to go? Oh, I've got lots of plans. <laughs> <laughs> you can go ahead and take my bags out. Okay. Thanks a lot, Ray. Yeah, thanks, Ray. Well, I guess it's time for me to be moseying. I better head down to personnel and turn in my parking pass. Later, Gator. Goodbye. And so, as he heads off to new adventures, he leaves behind a genuine legacy of success and a company at the top of the industry. Good luck, Bruce. And thanks. Thanks.